love you too. I know it's looking a mess in here now, ain't it? That's how I start to look when you're getting everything together. Right now, I'm working on this wire harness. I'm finishing up the wiring. Pretty much got all of it down packed. I think. Got a few solders to run. Um, right now, I'm working on this fuel pump wiring. Got everything set. All I need to do is set that battery. And um, all this time, I've been waiting on the PCM. I had never got the PCM program because I was waiting to make sure all the parts I had. So I finally got the PCM programmed. Um, I sent it to Brandon, Brandon, Brandon L, at uh, LT1Swaps.com. And uh, it took him about a week. Well, not took him about a week, but it took about a week for everything to process. And that's from the point of me shipping it off to him and uh, me receiving it. So it should be here Friday. Yeah, Friday. Let me see. Yeah, I sent, I sent it off last Tuesday. He, he received it Friday. He sent it off Tuesday, which was a week. And then I should receive it Friday. However we go. Yeah, y'all get it. But uh yeah, I'm trying to finish up finish up the wiring. I ran my uh oh, sorry about that. I ran my uh aftermarket harness right down there. I don't know if y'all can see. I ran it down there, but I'm I'm in the process of re uh rerouting everything. Sorry about my voice. I think I'm coming down with a little cold or something. A little summer cold. A little stuffy but uh yeah this is the wiring process i'm out here um ten eighteen at night i'm out in the garage solo dolo but yeah man let me get back to this wiring um I'm running all new power wires for the uh for the battery and the alternator. Um I want to go with zero gauge wiring for everything, but I already ordered 4 gauge which was fa uh factory on this car, 4 gauge wire, so I got 4 gauge OFC that I'm going to run for now and then um I'm going to buy a roll of uh probably like 50 foot of OFC wire when I re when I run wires for the uh, music, I'm going to redo all the, the power wires also. So for right now, I'm going to run this new 4-gauge wire I got. Let me show you. As you can see, I got it marked off for the um, three power wires that I'm going to run for now. Shrink wrap. Shrink wrap. But, uh, so this is, uh, what I'm gonna run for now. But as you can see on the cart, I got all the rest of This is the power wire that came with the truck that runs from the, uh, alternator. This is a little power junction box. I'm thinking about keeping this. I like this. I want to infuse this somewhere, even though the Caprice al already comes with one, but I still want to keep this and put this somewhere because I think when I, uh, I want to take this alternator wire off. Yeah, I'm going to run this to the battery, keep this box, and uh, take this. Oh, some hard wire, that's that welding wire. But anyways, on a little boat that this go on in here, I'm going to run a wire from here to the trunk so that I can run subs. 
So I want to keep this wire and all the rest of this stuff is all the ground and stuff that I got. But I'm, uh, yeah, like I said, I'm, I'm going to get the, uh, the zero gauge to run the power everywhere. But this is what it's looking like so far. As you can see, I got the, this the K&N air filter off my pickup truck. I'm just doing it for test runs. I'm going to put it back on the truck and I'm going to buy one for the car. But uh, I just needed something out so I can start it. But hopefully I can get it started by this weekend. Like I said, I'm finishing up the wiring now. PCM should be in by Friday. And uh, we should have our first start. Let's get it. Three days later. Yo, what up, YouTube? Yes, sir. Got that package in the mail today. LT1Swaps.com, baby. Yes, sir. Got almost everything ran. Get on out here. Got my wires ran. Got my wires ran. Ready for the computer. Just gotta mount the fuse box. Um, ground it off and these just the extra wires that I got to hook up so I got these wires right here ready so I already integrated everything let me see what I... and I got this wire bundle right here that need to run through the firewall and hook up to those extra wires that I got right there and that's all the wires. After that, just hook up the computer. Got this box I need to still put right there. But uh, run my power cables, and I should be able to start it up. Yes, sir. I got the package in earlier, as y'all can see. It's kind of late now. I had to do some yard work. But uh, sorry about that. I hit the stop button for some reason but uh yeah i just wanted to show y'all i got the package in and uh it's kind of late so i'm about to go in call it a night i got work tomorrow but i just wanted to bring y'all this unboxing of this package i got let's see should have a blade yes. go from this end I sent it in. Yes, sir. So this is the PCM I'm running. The uh, 411, 0411 PCM. So I did send this off to uh, Brandon at LT1Swap.com. Like I said, the turnaround time was about a week. I sent it out to him with all the information that I needed. And uh, he sent it back to me. Just got it in the mail today. 
So uh, tomorrow when I get off work, hopefully I'll come through, uh, run the power wires. I got some power wires right here that I'm going to run just to get it started. But uh, yeah, that's it. Like I said, I just wanted to show y'all the unboxing of the uh, PCM, that I, my PCM that I got back from LT1Swap.com. And uh, fingers crossed, y'all. Fingers crossed. All I got to do is run the power wires. Oh, yeah. Run my hot and my ground. Throw in the spark plug and wires. And uh, hook up that PCM. And hopefully we can get our first crank tomorrow. Stay locked in.